Okay, guys, we're here with Zeke. Zeke is a new patient. Where are you coming from, Zeke? Uh, Cypress, Texas. Okay, all right. Um, it looks to me like you have a pretty unusual uh, finger there. One, uh, do you have a story? Yeah, it was bitten by a baby rattlesnake. Baby rattlesnake? Yeah. Where did this occur? In a, in a boat dock in uh, Lake Travis in Austin. No kidding. How long ago? Uh, last Friday at dusk. Okay, so four days ago, roughly? Uh, a week ago. Oh, a week and Okay, so yeah. almost 10 days now. Yeah. All right, and you went to the emergency room, right? Yeah, that's correct. And uh, you still are quite a bit swollen there. I bet it was more swollen then. It was pretty swollen, yeah. And they put you, they admitted you to the hospital, I presume? Yes, sir, that's okay. correct. And they gave you the anti-venin. Yes. And how many days were you in the hospital? Four. Four days. And they monitored your kidney function, right? I believe so, yeah. And they monitored your liver function too, I'm sure, as well as your blood count and all of your clotting parameters, all the things that can be affected by a snake bite or what we call a pit viper bite. Now, do you have normal feeling at the tip of your finger? I don't. You don't. You can't feel, you don't really feel me touching here. I know you're touching, but I don't have any, any kind right. of tactile feeling. Because you can actually see me. Do you feel okay back here? That's fine. That's fine. But up in here? That's fine. It's just been... That's the problem right, that's right there. there. So we have some nerve damage here from a snake bite. Now, are you able to uh, wiggle the finger okay? So the skin's kind of tight right there. Yeah. You can definitely see where it's doing its accordion thing, but yeah. I'm able to move the finger, yeah. It's... Yeah. So uh, did they give you any kind of prognosis as to whether or not you may get some return of the sensation at the tip of the finger? We have not discussed that. Okay. All right. Uh, the answer is... Uh, we don't know. Okay, you may get some return of sensation uh, mm -hmm. or you may not. That's the correct answer. Yeah. So there's a possibility that you, know, you could regenerate some sensation to the tip uh, or you may not. Hopefully you will. And I'm going to press on it a little bit here and just make sure. So you've got good capillary refill. Mm -hmm. Press down, you can see the, the white color comes in. And then when I let go, the, the nice pink, healthy blood flow returns. So that's a good sign, and some of this here will slough off. This will just dry up and kind of fall off. Are you still taking any antibiotics or anything? I am. You are, okay. Clindamycin, I think. Clindamycin? Clindamycin. Clindamycin, okay. Yeah. Anytime you have a puncture wound, mm -hmm. uh, clindamycin is, is a pretty good choice. All right, Zeke, man, thanks for sharing with us, and, and uh, you're going to have a whole lot of people that are going to pray for you and uh, send you good thoughts and wishes and hope that your finger heals completely. Cheers. All right. How's it going, Coconut? It's going. It's going well? It's going well. Was that pretty interesting? That was cool. All right. Say thanks, Zeke. Thank you, Zeke. Mm. So I have, thank you for helping out that patient. You're earlier. welcome. So usually this patient came in with her daughter, for her daughter, and her daughter was the patient. She usually sit on the table, the mom sits in the chair. Today it's about her, but she came with her daughter still, because they both love to come to see us. Well, of course. So she tried to get on the, the, the table, and all I heard was like, whoa, whoa, whoa. So I went in there, she grabbed on the handle. It was in room six, she was already on the floor. Her daughter was really fast. She jumped over and and caught her hair. She would have. Yeah. And then oh, Dr. Gilmore wow. came to the rescue. I'm just glad she didn't bump her head or something. That would have been bad. Oh, that would be wow. bad. That's what and I her knee like, just gave out thing? on her. She had one bad knee, one okay knee. You gotta get Monica it was so hard to in a video. <laughs> Why do you want to get Monica in a video? Because I think you haven't made a video <laughs> yet. <laughs> no, never made a video. <laughs> Donna was and there. What is your role Alexis at the Cypress Liquid Clinic? We could not. The office do. manager. And a good one, too. Thanks. Oh my. Thanks. <laughs>